Okay, so um, I just figured that right now I think it's the crunch time. So they are changing time lines and um, you know and trying to go back to the time that is most favorable to them right so we are changing timelines and you know we already feel you know like a major evidence we don't really need to like find evidence ourselves but we already experiencing it right and so my analogy is the conclusion of the you know of the past few weeks if not uh, like a month or two at least it's been really chaotic you know I figured that at least they try to jump timeline and play with the time um, at least like once a week because I've noticed that the past few weeks like every week like people's um, attitude particularly towards me of course and um, you know like the things that I've noticed they technically changed like weekly it, like obviously I think they try to change um, like jump timelines at, at least one or twice a week because right now it's the clear evidence that the trigger event which is a uh, rapture is going to happen at any second nanosecond now so that's why they um, they try to switch timeline as much as possible to find the favorable favorable timeline um or and or like go back to the favorable time on the favorable timeline so let's say for example like uh last month okay so it's been at least could be at least um a month and a half or two months now so last month um like for example week one um the lady she was in charge of something okay so uh when she saw me um after i i you know i uh, managed to finish that for her and the next day when she saw me she was so like appreciate my help and she was so um glad to see me and gave me a like a european style of hug so then the following week all of a sudden she like when she when she saw me she told her attitude is totally changed to like very cold and um pretending that i wasn't there at all so you could tell the difference between only within a week um is like a 36 degree opposite changed even like I could say like if some people like jealous of me and like bullshitting behind my back about like me and making false accusations against me but still it just I've got the feeling it's like the dynamic has changed all of a sudden so then the next week so it's like week one and then week two and then week three 
when I saw her, she like kind of neutral, like not really, really like a hundred percent neutral, but like it's a little bit of, of improvement. Um, but then again, it went down south. Uh, so because week one and week three, I've done, I've you know like, um. I helped her to finish something. For example, I finished like week one, finished one project, and week three, finished another project. Um, so, like on time and like with um, exceeded uh, expectations. Okay, so week one is like very nice and friendly and like appreciative. Then week two, like cold and like. Ignore, ignore me. Like trying to. Then um, week three was like a little bit neutral. Uh, you know, like geared towards like thank appreciative, but like still like, get the vibe of uh, you know um, treating me as an enemy, but a little bit better than week two. Then week four is like total disaster. It's like um. Again, you know, you know, like things like been changing like crazy. Um, I mean, it's not only her, but like I just um used her as as an example, and um like her attitude change and every uh, actions and everything like obviously like really obvious. And so then, um, the past week or two, like her attitude changed like daily. Um, so the past week, the attack was pretty much a full on everything. Um, so now I am trying to recovering like physically my health. Because the attacks been extreme, the past two weeks, uh, ever since that stupid wildfire in Montreal, in Canada, um, uh, I know that a lot of people's health got um, affected, and uh, so that's that. Then, uh, let's see. That's uh, one evidence of uh, jumping timelines and like finding a favorable timeline for themselves. Okay, and then um, I figured that you know even though like we are able to find three books of Enoch online. Um, and other books that are not online that we cannot find, you know, uh, Enoch he wrote. Um, I don't remember how many, like let's say fifty three or more than that, or like you know, not only three books. So, and then I read those three books, right? And um, he. Like he scribed what God told him, and all the angels, right, uh, told him, and he said, uh, Adam and Eve cast down from heaven up to earth, right, and then God started to change their physical, um, to like have a stomach to digest food, and then have you know sexual organs to have sex, and like pregnant, and you know. For children, etc. Then it's kind of like contradiction of what is it's uh in the Genesis, right? The Genesis it says that uh, Satan had sex with Eve, and in heaven, and Eve pregnant with his child is Cain. So that's a discrepancy between Genesis and Book of Enoch. So I don't think either of one 
is telling the original story because you know they the saint has been um, uh, modifying Bibles and Book of Enoch for like for ever since like um, they found the books right, and they've been uh, adding and subtracting informations and then the translation that they provided. Oh, absolutely not accurate, right? So I'm not sure how to, you know, um, link Book of Enoch and Genesis together because of that. Because you know we lost all the information, and you know the saint is um, only give us the. Versions that they wanted us to read, right? So um, there's no way I can make the connection between the two, and also like put together an an analysis and a result from what I observed and.、Um, So I believe. Let's see. We of course we. Okay, of course, human didn't have physical bodies in heaven. Adam and Eve. Level. I think like actually. Is a tribe. And not only one Adam and one Eve, it should be like a group of people, like a family or like a tribe that God created. And、um, so before Eve, Eve Lily, it's Lily, right? It was Lily that was the first woman.、Um, and then he. I mean, she had sex with Satan and all the fallen, not all, but you know, some of the fallen angels. Um, so I believe at that time already have in heaven already had sex and um pregnancy. But it doesn't mean that they had to have a physical body, right? So they supernaturally had sex and then pregnant supernaturally. It could also be, you know, wasn't happen in heaven. It was happen on earth. During that time, earth was a void. So Satan probably, you know, it could be like Satan brought Lily. Lilith, sorry, it's not Lily. It's Lilith. Lilith to Earth, which is the void, and had sex. So they already changed physically, like、uh, from a light body to something else in between of light bodies and physical body. Right? It's like a you know. So when they went back to heaven. Obviously, they changed. Obviously, they like cannot escape from God's wrath because you know. So then, you know, when God created, um, who's that? If, <sighs> and then, um, Adam and if. You know, like that whole tribe, or like I don't know. Is it only one tribe, maybe two? You know, we never know. So that both of them came casted down from heaven to earth, and then God gave them physical bodies. You know, in Garden of 
eaten, they could eat. But it's spiritually, it's spiritual fruits. So once they cast it down here on earth, God literally gave them physical bodies. And physical organs to digest food and all the stuff, right? That is more、um, logical. That could link Genesis and Book of Enoch together. Um. So during that time, all the monsters that from Lilith, between Lilith and fallen angels and Satan, those monsters, not nephilims, they are literally monsters. So that's why.、Um, There are so many creatures. So we have devils, like the creatures, like the union between Lilith and fallen angels. They created like evil creatures, and then Nephilim is when the woman on Earth. Had sex sex with fallen angels than Nephilims, and before all this, like Sophia was the first to fall, and then she created so many like evil creatures as well. So there are so many different types of evil creatures. Um. So that's、um, is what I wanted to share.、Um, let's see. So right now is the sixteenth Friday.、Um, is the end of the twenty seventh day of the third month. We are approaching the fourth month in in our calendar, and the fifth month in Chinese calendar.、Um, so the Golden and silver gates will be opened on next Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And then, so Tuesday. The first day of the fourth month in Enoch calendar is the nineteenth Monday. So it's、uh, technically it will begin this coming Sunday, the eighteenth, then the nineteenth, and then end on Tuesday, the twentieth. So the Tuesday is the first. Second, ah,、uh, and okay. So from Tuesday to Thursday is the first to the fifth, roughly speaking. First and fifth to fifth, first, second, third, fourth, and the beginning of fifth day of the fourth um month in in our calendar. Um, and then the tenth day of the fourth month in Ela calendar will be、um, on the following Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So it's the twenty seven, twenty eight, and twenty nine.、Uh, okay. So、um, Noah and everybody got on the boat, which is got raptured on the tenth day of the month. So. 
Thai watch time is the twenty seven, twenty eight, and twenty nine. Um, I don't know how to reconcile that, but um, you know, we can never understand everything. But so look at the calendar. If the golden and silver gates. Are opening on the twentieth, twenty-first, and twenty-second, which is the midsummer. Three days. The three days opening. You know, like the whole ten days. Is time stand still. The whole tenth day of the fourth month. First tenth day, the time stands still. Then three days of darkness. Then alien invasion soap opera. Put on a show. They will put on that show. So ten, then three days is, yeah, exactly. Yep.